Hey everybody, welcome to my channel. My name is Tanya with 50 is not old and today we're talking all kinds of little cute gadgets and products that I bet you didn't know you needed but by the end of this video you might change your mind. So let's get started. So if you haven't already liked and subscribed to my blog, please do so and that way you will get notifications and find out all kinds of tips, tricks, and styles on looking confident into your 50s and beyond. And not only that, but you'll find all kinds of little gadgets too. So today we're talking gadgets. So I went on Amazon and I found all kinds of things I just had to have. And we're going to take a look at all of them and then I'll show you how I use them in a little bit. So first up, pillowcases. Now I don't know about you, but all of us need pillowcases, so I thought this would be a good one for all of us. But what I loved about these is they are the satin pillowcases. Love this color and I did order the larger size for my king size bed. Holy crap, these are huge. <laughs> I don't think I have pillows that big. I could get both pillows in them. Anyway, I love this. Love it for your hair and love it for your skin. If you're not already sleeping on a satin pillowcase, you really should. It doesn't frizz your hair and it is better for you as you age. It helps with not getting all those wrinkles in your skin. So that one is a great one. Um, I'll link all this stuff to you, for you below and Let's see about this one. I'm not too sure about this one. When I ordered it, well, this isn't a gadget. Um, this is clothing. But I ordered it because it, one, it had a ton, a ton of people who had ordered it. Oh, I like the material. That is super soft. Love that softness. But what I ordered it for is because it has this ruching down the sides. Now, I'm not sure how to look on me. We'll have to try that on later, but it is supposed to be tight here at the waist and then like this is what it, oh, okay, never mind. This is what it looks like on me. <laughs> there you go. Now you've seen it. Uh, let's go on. Next item. What do we get? What do we get? <laughs> okay. So as a fashion blogger, a lot of what I end up doing is changing clothes in the car. Now, I don't know how fun you think that sounds, but it's not very fun. And um, all the time, oh, it comes in its own little pouch, cute. And I'm all the time having to park right next to another car who sometimes comes, oops, it pops open. See how they, oh, there's four of them. I thought there was only two of them. Cool, there's four of them. These are sunshades and they are cling wrap. So in other words, you just press them to your window and they clean. And that is just gonna give me a tiny bit of protection for, for me, what I'm wanting them for is because of changing clothes, but it's gonna be just a tiny bit of protection from the sun if you have children or you just want extra sunscreen, sun, sunscreen then you just throw these on the windows and then they just peel right off. As I said, it's just cling wrap. So there's four of those in that pack. Okay, sounds wonderful. What's next? Okay, Vanity Planet. Now Vanity Planet, I've actually got a couple of things I ordered from Vanity Planet. And it is like a Clarisonic. Have you seen Clarisonic? So it's got different heads, different brushes, and it is for helping clean your skin. Okay, so now I'm going to show you how to use this little face cleaning tool. I've already got four AA batteries in it and I have the heads here. This is the pumice stone head and that is for your feet, calluses, elbows, etc. We have the exfoliating head, which is a little bit not quite as dense. You can see it's a little more sparse versus the daily cleansing head, which is very uh, dense but they're all extremely soft. So they just pop right on like that, pull off to change, 
and let me type my mic up. Okay, I'm wetting my face and putting on some cleanser. And then I'm going to wet my brush and let's turn it on. Ooh, okay. Wow. <laughs> Throwing water everywhere. That's pretty good. Turn it off before I, and then rinse it clean and pull it out and let it dry. That was actually, um, that was actually nice. I liked that. So I have a trip planned here in just a couple of weeks. And one of the things I hate when traveling is that you get there and your clothes look like they have been traveling. So they're all wrinkled and nasty looking and a mess. This is a portable steamer. And I love the idea of this. I'm gonna, can't wait to try it. Let's check it out and see how it looks and I'll show you how that works here in just a little bit. This is a plunger and a brush for your back brush. Now, we have a fairly new house and I have these in all of my lower bathrooms. However, I don't have them in the upstairs bathrooms, which is where guests, guests would stay. And my husband's like, well, Tanya, you know, we don't need one in every single bathroom. And I'm like, are you kidding? Would you like to be a guest in someone's house and need a plunger and have to come downstairs and say, hey, I need a plunger? So, yeah. I like this, that it's a combo. It just sits in the corner, and then you have your plunger on one side, and you have a brush to clean the commode on the other side. So, this is something everybody needs, whether you know it or not. Okay, two more items and we're done. So I don't know if you've seen some of the dry bar brushes that these dry and brush your hair at the same time. It's supposed to give you lots of volume and thickness and I can't wait to try this one. This one's by Revlon, so it's a brand you already know and trust and so it says it's got a fan favorite and over 29,000 reviews. So yeah, let's try it. Okay, so I have my hair damp. It's not completely sopping wet, but it is damp. And I'm going to try this, and I do like the hot pink. This Revlon, what's it called? Uh, One Step Hair Dryer and Volumizer. Okay. So it is lightweight, not really heavy at all. It does have multiple settings, adjustable settings for heat. It says it's tangle free and that this part here is cool so you can touch it without it being hot. So let's get started.
Okay. Whoops, let's hope it still works. Um, so pros and cons from it, you know, and I have to admit, I have a Dyson hair dryer, so I'm used to getting my hair dry really, really fast. And this takes a little bit more time, but I do like that it has, I'm looking at my hair in the mirror, sorry. I do like that it has the brush attachment because now this is all smooth. It's not like crinkly and frizzy and everything. So I do like that. Of course, it's not completely dry. But anyway, um, another thing I like about it is it did not tangle my hair. I was really skeptical about going round and round and round with a brush, but it did not tangle my hair at all. So you know what? It's not a bad deal and it's a whole lot cheaper than my Dyson. <laughs> anyway, I kind of like it. This, so this is a steamer. And I've heard a lot about this, and I've not tried it yet, but I've heard a ton about it. It is also by Vanity Planet. And of course, it's a box in a box. Don't you just hate that? Anyway, a box in a box. And I, I will show you how to use it here in a little bit. But basically, it hydrates and it softens the skin. And what it really does is it opens the pores. So that is really something that's really good. Um, used with essential oils for a therapeutic experience, clarifies the skin's complexion and makes your skin more receptive to skin care treatments. So that's the part I bought it for, is you use this, the steam opens up your pores, and then your products can get to them a lot easier. And I can't wait to try that, but I'll have to go take off my makeup first. Now it's time to move on to steaming my face. So look, they gave cute little bunny ears to hold my hair out of my eyes. That's cute, 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 cute. Anyway, so I've looked over the instructions. I have put distilled water in the tank. I don't use essential oils, but they have three little essential oil they call them baskets that you could use. And I'm ready. I think I've already cleaned my face. We, you all helped, saw me clean my face. So I'm pushing the button now to see. And I can hear, oh, yeah, there's a little steam coming out. Let me get where you can see that. I have to admit, I didn't much think I would like this little product, uh, but I loved that product. Wow, it really steamed my face, got my face all ready, and now it's time I'm going to go ahead and finish with my skincare. Next product will be my toner. So this was a thumbs up for me. I really, really enjoyed that one. These are the products I have uh, to show you today from my Amazon finds, and actually I've got a couple of things that right there. That's an Amazon find. That um, photo, Amazon find. There's a desk over there, Amazon find. More prints, Amazon find. My rug, you can't see it. I'll show that at another day, Amazon find. So Amazon is a great place to find lots of stuff you didn't know you need, but can't hardly live without. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed this. I'll put everything in, down below in the comments. So um, be sure to like and follow and comment. Let me know what you would like to see more of. Goodbye.